Hey guys, so I saw that I got a new update for my Samsung Galaxy Note 2 and it's an update that I've been waiting for a few days now before so I'm just gonna go ahead and turn on my Wi-Fi so I can go ahead and update to the update which should give me a cool new feature actually so getting IP address um, okay so I'm all loaded on forward one you can do Hmm. Okay, interesting. That's pretty fucking weird. It should be able to update. Maybe, maybe if we do it again. Uh, program updates. There we go. Okay, finally. So it should be a update to Android 4.1.1 Jelly Bean. A, a update that will uh, come with a new feature that's already in Galaxy Note 10.1. So let's see, it's around 10 megabytes. Okay, okay. Uh, okay, 10 megabytes. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and install it. Okay, the unit will restart. And hopefully everything will work out as it should. There we go, no 10.1, no, no 2, and it's doing the updates. And of course, I haven't flashed any custom ROMs or anything, this is the fresh, uh, my fresh Galaxy Note 2, you know, with the firmware that it did come installed with. The other one I did smash. Fifty percent. Uh, there should also be an update for the Galaxy S3 that's starting to roll out now again, and that is the 4.1 like the Jelly Bean update for the Galaxy S3 users. Uh, now Samsung started to push out this update earlier this month, and then they they decide to stop and uh, you know draw it back. That was just because they had some issues with it, like. Some people had like battery drain issues, like I had battery drain issues because I flashed the Poland version of Android 4 with one Jelly Bean for the Galaxy S3 and I got some really, really amazing, you know, sick battery drain issues and that's why Samsung pushed uh, back that update. Uh, so yeah, it was actually Samsung that failed over there with the update for the Galaxy S3. Now hopefully this update won't be a fail, hopefully. And shouldn't because it's just a small update. Small little tweak to add a form with the 1.1 Jelly Bean. Or maybe it is a little bit more also. Hmm. We will see. So it's doing it's start up again. There we go. Samsung logo. Should start up in just a few seconds right now. There we go. So it's optimizing some apps. I have 99 apps. Maybe I should download one more. Just one more. So, you know. There we go, 80 apps out of 99, it's going up all the time. There we go. Okay, sweet. So everything should be up now and running again. 
So um, I'm just gonna wait here a few seconds. Go. Okay, the unit has been updated. Sweet. So it's been updating to let's see. Android 4.1.1, but there's like a new baseband version. And let's see here. I think I actually know what this update is doing and I'm probably gonna go ahead and check it out in another video uh, because it requires me to test it out first. Uh, but yeah, quick video here updating my Galaxy Note 2 to the latest edition here, the latest version. Let's see here if you go here to about device. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and try this out. I think I know how this update works. Hmm. Maybe I don't. Maybe I have to research it more. But I got an update for something, and uh, I will research it a little bit more to see what what it's doing. Uh, but yeah, quick video here uh, installing it on my Galaxy Note 2. Have a good one.